hello everyone welcome back to our channel here we have one problem that is square root of 6 square root of 6 square root of 6 square root of 6 equals 216 to the power of x so how do we solve this problem let's see solution so square root of 6 square root of 6 square root of 6 square root of 6 we have 4 square root square roots so equal to 216 to the power of x so first do these calculations first one so here we can use this formula square root of a equal to a to the power of 1 by 2 ok use this formula here we can write square root of 6 square root of 6 square root of 6 so square root of 6 which is equal to times a to the sorry 6 to the power of 1 by 2 equal so 216 we can write it as so we can write it as 216 can be written as 6 to the power of 3 so 216 equal 6 power 3 so hold to the power of x so now now here here we can use this formula a to the power of m times a to the power of n equal to a to the power of m plus n. Okay, use this formula here we can write square root of 6 square root of 6. So do these calculations. So here one is there. So square root of 6 to the power of 1 plus 1 by 2 equal 6 power so multiply these two terms 3 times x 3x so now square root of 6 square root of 6 so square root of 6 1 plus 1 by 2 is there so multiply these two terms 1 times 2 so here 2 so 2 plus 1 divided by 2 so 2 plus 1 3 we will get 3 by 2 so square root of 6 to the power of 3 by 2 we will get 6 to the power of 3 by 2 equal 6 to the power of 3 power 3x so now square root of 6 square root of 6 so do these calculations so again use this formula we can write times 6 to the power of 3 by 2 whole to the power of 1 by 2 equal 6 to the power of 3x so multiply these two terms square root of 6 square root of 6 times so multiply these two terms so 3 times 1 6 to the power of 3 times 1 3 and 2 times 2 divided by 4 equal 6 to the power of 3x so now again use this formula square root of 6 square root of so here 1 is there so 6 to the power of 1 plus 3 by 4 equal 6 to the power of 3x equal square root of 6 square root of 6 so 1 plus 3 by 4 which is equal so 1 times 4 4 plus 3 7 7 by 4 say 7 by 4 we will get 7 by 4 equal 6 to the power of 3x so now again use this formula we can write square root of 6 and times 6 to the power of 7 by 4 to the power of 1 by 2 equal 6 to the power of 3x so now 
square root of 6 so 6 times so now multiply these two terms so 6 to the power of 7 times 1 7 and 4 times 2 8 equal 6 to the power of 3x so again again use this formula so use this formula here we can write square root of here 1 is there so 6 to the power of 1 plus 7 by 8 equal 6 to the power of 3x so square root of 6 to the power of 1 plus 7 by 8 which is equal to, so 8 times 1 8 8 plus 7 8 plus 7 divided by 8 so 8 plus 7 which is equal to 15 so 15 divided by 8 okay 6 to the 6 to the power of 15 divided by 8 so equal 6 to the power of 3x now square root of we can write it as 6 to, 6 to the power of 15 divided by 8 whole to the power of 1 by 2 equal 6 to the power of 3x so now multiply these two terms so we will get 6 to the power of 15 times 1 which is equal 15 and 8 times 2 divided by 8 times 2 16 equal 6 to the power of 3x so see here now compare these two terms so we have same basis and exponents are different so we have to take only exponents so, so that is 3x equal 15 divided by 16 so 3 comes down x equal 15 divided by 16 divided by 3 so now here now we can write it as x equal 15 divided by 16 times 1 by 3 so 3 times 5 which is equal 15 so x equal 5 divided by 16 so this is x value ok this is the answer thank you for watching please do subscribe for more videos thank you and take care bye bye see you in the next video